Hello students, uh, Gate SPC Online Tuition welcomes you and uh, today we will discuss the basics of project management uh, uh, practice question for last module 1 and module 2. From this year what I will do, uh, I will just uh, give question like module wise, okay. For example, why I just completing like one module, I will just write some practice question, some conceptual question. Uh, so module wise module, after every module you will get some practice question just related to that module. That's why some uh, practice question as well as you will grip on subjects and uh, first of all I need to just suggest all students these questions what i am just picking from different uh, reference books or like um, last year question paper these questions are very very important for your exam these are not only question these are the part of like very important concept in this video you will just see i am just taking like only basic uh, some questions only but every question have different concept so that concept if you understand definitely your subject is going to be like uh, uh, very good for you and uh, so day by day, I will just put like this practice question after every module. So for this, like we have completed our basics of project management, two modules. So question practice for module one and module second, I just given here. I will not add like useless questions. Okay, I given the theory question or theoretical part is there. I, I need not to just define like one question for like what is the project management or what is the management. All questions just I keep aside. What question I need to just discuss here which are very important okay everything like every question is the concept here and uh, for uh, like uh, last year same thing but uh, some students just uh, commenting and messaging me sir how to buy this videos i will not put every videos only 25 percent videos are going to be with some cost okay i need to suggest all students just go with proper method why i am putting very like uh, some money for students because of uh, i am just also spending lots of like my time, my studies, my work, my everything just for my students, needful students. I am I I will I will not take like a big amount from you. I assure you. But very important thing, if you spend something, your sincerity towards your preparation is going to be very important. Once you are paying eighty thousand to your coaching center, you you are going to just daily classes because of you are spending. That's why if you are spending some money towards these modules your study is going to be in flow and definitely you will get uh, proper concepts and knowledge here in this my videos. Okay, so, and I assure you my modules are, all modules are, uh, last year I just made some all modules with cost, but this year content is more. I, I will add everything. You need not just bother about like questions I also add. I will just provide some extra questions in uh, some, uh, like last year just I provided seats are there. On website I will just provide as well as uh, I will just suggest one reference book for this upcoming month. So practice questions from also there. If you want to join in test series in future, you will just also get uh, practice questions from there. So don't feel any problem. If your dream is to become IES officer, don't feel any problem. You're like uh, small money here. And for books, uh, if you are reading from like any books, I just suggested all videos available on our channel. If you dream to become IES officer, your one month salary compensate everything. So don't feel any pressure with your cool mind, just study. And definitely if you're studying from day one and day by day, day by day, you will get more knowledgeable person. And I assure you, if you go through with my all subjects or like uh, all conceptual or videos, definitely after watching my videos, your mindset is something different. Okay, I will try my best for students who just want like, sir, um, uh, like how to buy or everything just given in uh, uh, like uh, last module second module just paid video okay so in uh, that video youtube is there so on youtube just type uh, module second is there so one link is there in description of that video just go there and uh, buy there okay after that uh, every video available on youtube some videos only paid or remaining others are free for students okay and one very important suggestion for my all students for example you are reading one module one and you are getting some problem in module one that I'm not getting uh, like uh, like this problem. So you can comment below only module one. If you are getting problem in module one, then uh, your comment should be in module one part of YouTube. Okay, for example, you are getting some problem in uh, this question practice um, for module one and module second. So comment in this video only below comments option is there. So ask if you have any doubt. If a special doubt is there, you can just go to messenger or you can just uh, send my like any images or anything you want. Okay, so this is going to be our like schedule and uh, before for all students who just asking me sir when you are going to complete this um, basics of project management or all syllabus 
last year just i started in august okay or july in, in last or starting of august and i just completed before one month definitely if um, i is starting from like uh, in april itself so definitely you will get more profit definitely you like in um, november okay or before uh, two months of your exam i assure you you will get your all syllabus as well as your like current affair module i will just provide in uh, before uh, 15 days of exam so i will provide up to date current affair to every student okay so don't feel any problem just only your main motto if you are study just live with me i am just all time just support my all students if uh, something like uh, if you want to do something in your life just start don't feel any pressure if you are loser or uh, you are winner or you are from iit or you are nit you are pass out candidate from last 5 years or you are pressure candidate you are in fourth year it doesn't matter if your motto is fixed definitely you will get your target okay so now we will discuss our basics of project management module 1 and module second question just see here first question i just taken from this is 2017 question okay so just see consider the following statements regarding project management first it is the process of attaining project objective in stipulated time to produce qualified and quantified deliverables okay guys two words are important here is is stipulated and your deliverables okay this word is important in project management deliverables okay guys deliverables means in every project we have something to create okay we have something to create some output is there okay some output is there so output or creation or product that is just on us what work we are doing in our projects just means sir this is only this uh, in another words in project management uh, words we just use word deliver deliverables okay and uh, this word stipulated means what requirement for our projects okay so this is a just listen this uh, this is asking about like project management we studied in our first module what is the project what is the management and the combination part of project management like uh, we have to do something for our project management so this is the definition of like project management just see it is the process of attaining project objective in stipulated time to produce quantified and uh, qualified or uh, outputs okay so quality should be there quantity should be there we should just uh, with our proper time we have proper budget okay so just only the part of our everything just uh, uh, project management okay so last in uh, in uh, first module just we given like sir we have like proper budget is there proper time is there proper uh, like uh, ek uh, quality is there okay so i need to just say ki wahan pe ek budget hota hai time hota hai aur quality hoti hai so uh, this is asking for uh, what is the project management so this is like it is a ek process hota hai and we need something uh, deliverable okay so this option is right second option just see it is the act of bringing together the responsibilities resources and people necessary to accomplish the business goals and objective with the specific time limitations with in the financial grants means budget okay so i just told project management any guys it doesn't matter in project management it is very important for all students who are just studying your definitions may change by person to person but your concepts like budget time your qualities are the part of basics of project management okay something very like uh, balance quadrant we will discuss in next question that is going to be very important question and i will discuss i will give basic idea what is the this okay so wherever you are get like financial condition limitations are there within time we need to do something so that is only like our project management okay or project management so both uh, like statements regarding to project management is right okay because of in project management what we will do uh, for example one project is there our managers or pro- our management what we will do uh, we will just take money we will create some product we will just deliver to our customers that is only the management okay project management according to so all in, in both definitions everything like right okay so uh, answer for this question just option c okay so you can just see sir all three like post, first option is right second option is also right so uh, you will get like idea what is the project management here just the next question very important question consider the following phase of project management again this is the es 2017 question and uh, you should understand 
they just ask for which of the above phases are relevant sequentially okay so some phases are there you know guys we have like project life cycle first is just our feasibility okay second phase is just our designing part third phase is sir our implementation fourth phase is sir our closing means sir feasibility means we will have some concepts okay conceptual stage okay our conceptual stage okay where idea is there after the designing means sir planning or definition of some project after that implementation or closing same thing this question just asking what first step you will do some steps that first idea will come then we will just design our product then we will just produce that product and finally we will close our product and deliver to customer okay so first of all our goal to identify the problem okay what problem is there everything uh, if we want to just create some project our first phase of anything just identification of problem so first is this second formulation formulation means we are formulating some concepts ideas some designings are there so everything just second formulation third is just appraisals appraisals means guys in every company if you are doing something uh, like different from your mind you need to take appraisal from your senior authorities your owners your managers your senior managers your owners like your sponsors okay your clients so that is going to be like a pre analysis fourth option just see implementation so uh, first step identification formulation appraisal and implementation so this is the sequence for this project management phase of life so what is the answer is going to for this uh, question okay this is going to be 1 2 3 4 option d is right okay so consider the following phase of project management which of the above phases are relevant sequentially okay so past second third fourth all the options like identify formulate appraisal and uh, implementation okay so implementation just third part finally if fifth option is also given there like fifth option is just closing so you can just see sir past second third fourth finally we will go for fifth step okay so this is going to your steps are going to be phase okay feasibility analysis we will discuss in next module designing uh, in next to next uh, implementation in uh, next to next to next module uh, closing in the last and finally we will discuss contract tenders and very important like portfolio manager program managers and some very important concept from project management and we will just complete this subject okay so this answer for this question is going to be t next question very very important question very very important question very very important concept i will teach from this question okay this is question just from is 2018 just recent last uh, like in january just uh, happened this pre exam this question just taken from that just listen project management is essentially all questions what i am taking from project management only relate this question just related to module 1 and module second theory that's why i am taking here okay so you need not to just bother like uh, I, everything just i studying i am just every question just giving here only related um, module i will just write question okay so this is related to project management again the definition part so just say project management is essentially the process to plan its implementation and to pre determine the pre wise need of resources including funds personal givings choice total duration of time quality standards so what do you mean by project management project management is nothing sir to determine like pre determine the period of wise okay when we need to just complete our project what quality product we need how much cost we need to spend how much time this project will take so our project management is nothing everything just only this so our first option statement again one is right and just see second option very important option very very important from here you can expect question definitely you can expect question just see this question i will just discuss as well as i will give very important concept here you will just have any idea Uh, about like scope cost and time and quality these are the four parameters for every project and we will discuss here just see in statement second of the four four dimensions not denying that uh, there can be some more okay some more but four is important of a project which scope cost 
टाइम एंड क्वालिटी ओनली एनी टू कैन बी प्री असाइंड अदर हैव टू अबाइड बाई अदर हैव टू अबाइड बाई टू अबाइड बाई ओके देर टू प्रिस्क्रिप्शन ओके दिस इज आस्किंग सर आउट ऑफ फोर क्वालिटीज फॉर एग्जाम्पल सर वी हैव फोर क्वालिटीज इन एवरी प्रोजेक्ट लाइक फोर सम डायमेंशन आर देर ओके डायमेंशन ओके फर्स्ट इज जस्ट वॉट इज द फर्स्ट स्कोप स्कोप मीन्स वर्क दिस इज अगेन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वर्ड फ्रॉम प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजमेंट स्कोप मीन्स वर्क वोट वर्क वी नीड टू जस्ट कंप्लीट इन दिस प्रोजेक्ट फर्स्ट क्वालिटी और फर्स्ट डायमेंशन सेकेंड जस्ट सी कॉस्ट हाउ मच कॉस्ट वी नीड टू स्पेंड हेयर सेकेंड थर्ड इज जस्ट योर टाइम वोट टाइम वी नीड टू जस्ट कंप्लीट दिस प्रोजेक्ट लास्ट इज जस्ट क्वालिटी ओके अदर ऑप्शन ऑल्सो मे बी देयर अदर डायमेंशन लाइक सम पर्सन हैव बजट सम पर्सन लाइक शेड्यूलिंग आर देयर एवरीथिंग बट नॉट इंपॉर्टेंट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दीज फोर ओके दैट्स वाई इन क्वेश्चन दे गिवन इट सेल्फ दीज दिस लाइक ऑल फोर्स नॉन विथ सम नेम इन नेक्स्ट पेज आई विल डिस्कस दिस कॉन्सेप्ट ओके सो दिस क्वेश्चन जस्ट ओनली आस्किंग ओनली आउट ऑफ फोर इफ वी विल टेक ओनली टू इन कंसिडरेशन एंड टू जस्ट अबाइट सो इट इज गुड नो i am just want to tell you all fours are very important okay very very important we need to just before starting every project we need to consider all these four qualities okay at the time of starting you can take three fourth automatically will decide okay for example sir my work is fixed my cost is fixed my time is fixed i want to create one project into 20 lakh okay so automatically if you fix time your your cost or your work is fixed then your quality you need to just reduce for example sir my i i want to increase my cost okay if you increase your cost definitely your quality is going to be right for example one china one uh, mobile phone is there just listen very important example from this you will just uh, take many concept here just uh, one apple mobile okay and one any chinese company mobile okay any mobile is there just listen this is the apple and this is the china mobile okay same thing you will get in this mobile as well in this mobile but what you will they quality okay so in project of apple you need to just uh, give more quality so if you are increasing quality cost is automatically going to be right but here quality is you need to just compromise decrease cost is less okay so if you want to just increase something you need to compromise in something okay so four qualities are there your time if you want to just do your project very fast you need to spend money if your work is small you need to spend less money if you want quality high you need to spend more cost if uh, you can just compromise in cost quality in your uh, time okay some project for example uh, very important project some uh, some person is telling i i want this project in the next 15 days for 15 days because of this is the time bounded this project originally happen in 3 months but you need only 15 days you want in 15 days what you will do you will spend more and more and more money okay so this is going to be like um, uh, this types of projects uh, like topics are there okay so uh, statement third second is wrong okay here only statement first is right second is wrong for this more idea i will give in next phase just listen here very very properly this topic just known as A very important concept from here i need this is the is question uh, last year i discussed in uh, our quality management quality topics okay so just listen balance quadrant this is very important balance quadrant is nothing only this last topics what i just told four qualities like uh, four dimensions of any project management the balance quadrant the balance quadrant is a very useful tool when you are just dealing with a number of request to or uh, change in the scope of your project there are four factors that are balanced in any project time cost quality scope okay so this should be balancing balancing should be there balance should be there for example our time our cost our quality our scope any project is there it should be balanced okay balance should be there for example sir i want to change this project just listen i want to sir i need quality is more i need more quality 
means quality i need to just increase what this uh, balance quadrant will come just listen your time is fixed your cost cannot be fixed because of your scope is fixed only three can be fixed other going to be automatically changed okay time is fixed and your quality you want to rise up to here okay you want to rise your quality up to here means sir just see from last time this quality is here but you are rising your quality up to here okay so what you need to do this quadrant to make this quadrant balance okay this like uh, this balancing of this quadrant what you need to do you need to provide extra cost here some extra code to increase your quality okay so what happened guys same this like uh, like same understanding i given in the example for example again i just given last in last time in last uh, page i just given one example for example apple mobile or chinese mobile okay so what you need you are uh, in 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 this uh, case in apple case okay in apple case we need to just uh, increase our quality what you need to just reduce cost sorry what is going to be increase our cost cost bad jayegi wahan pe aur quality automatically badhegi jab quality hum bada rahe hain to cost humko badhani padegi okay so this is going to be balanced fir uske baad mein kya hoga ki sir maine jaise china ka mobile banana hai ki jaise hair time hair cost and hair quality and hair scope we want to just increase decrease our quality we want to just decrease our quality to make this balance we need to our automatically our cost is going to be reduced okay so all time this is going to be balanced quadrant okay so all qualities are important every project management so that's why this concept is very very important okay so i just expect any questions from this like quality management uh, same topic you will discuss in quality management or quality standards and quality subject so every subject just related that's why just step by step i teach just listen next so this is going to be like a quality management should be there now very important topic just listen change one uh, in one will impact others automatically we will just seen if we want to just uh, decrease our time agar time badhana hai to something we need to just again uh, compromise so everything just interrelated four things are everything just in your mind like time cost scope and quality next just see cost time and scope are also called triple constraint triangle okay very important this is your cost this is your time this is your scope okay scope is nothing just only work what we are doing in uh, our project okay so these three are very very important and these three are very very interrelated okay very much interrelated these all three are okay that's why this is just known as triple triangle constraint triangle okay so directly many times just they ask which is the part of triple triangle is scope is part your cost is part time is part quality is not part okay in other combination you can just make uh, also triangle with quality but uh, especially if you know this uh, triple constraint quadrant is just uh, known as this uh, cost time and scope okay all three are the part this is the note this is again important direct question triple constraint triangle consist your cost time scope but balance quadrant all four okay so everything just balance in every project if we are just starting our project time should be uh, our matter cost should be matter quality should be matter scope should be matter so why we study project management sir we need some our money should be less and our product should be good so our main motto for all engineers we study this uh, project management we need to just apply some principles some rules regulations are there our products also should be good for example if we are not making quality products our company is going to be reduced in uh, revenues in upcoming year so everything is important time binded products are need tool cost should be proper scope should be proper work should be proper quality should be proper so everything just you need to just make balance so this is the one concept from this topic and that's why just uh, statement second is wrong you can just say of oh, four dimensions with scopes just now just listen this question four dimensions okay denying other can show you scopes cost time and quality only any two can be pre assigned no 
minimum three can be assigned. For example, time assigning, scope assigning, quality assigning, cost automatically will assign. Okay, so minimum three is there. So two option is given there. Just listen, this is only given two. So this is a wrong option. So only first option is right in this question. Just see, this is okay. Just see, next question. At what stage in the project life cycle would cost be lowest? Just listen. You know, sir, we have four stages in our life cycle of any project. Okay. This is life cycle of project. This is the, your, uh, what types of uh, phases of any project. Okay. This is the feasibility. This is the designing phase. And uh, this is the implementation phase. And uh, this is the closing. You know, everywhere we have four steps only in project. Every project from small to big, feasibility analysis, designing, implementation, and closing. So what happened, guys? Our this uh, cost versus, this is the life cycle. This is the time, and this will take your cost. Cost in starting, for example, I, I, I have some startup idea in my mind. For example, I want to create some uh, uh, robot, okay? I have something idea in my mind. So my concept will take some time. But uh, for example, my one crore is product. I am spending only 15 lakh. Oh, sorry, 15 lakh is more. 5 lakh for our, uh, this uh, conceptual phase. Concept or like feasibility analysis. Means some paperwork is there. Some starting work is there. So only 5 lakh for concept. For designing, you need to spend for like 10 lakh rupees. For implementation, implementation means uh, from papers to we have like uh, some specification on paper. We want, we want to convert in real teach. So really, if you want to converting, we are producing some product. So at the time of implementation, we have maximum expenditure or we need to just spend more money. Closing, we need to just very less. Okay, again. But uh, this question just asking about what phase of this project life cycle. We know everyone know four life cycles are there. Okay, so which phase just take max minimum mini minimum cost cost is lowest. So conceptual stage is the answer for this. In the conceptual phase, we spend very less money. In designing phase, second time we just spending here money. In implementation maximum closing somewhat moderate. Okay, closing phase or also like some audits are there. Some projects recreation are there. Also designing and closing some moderate cost are there. But lowest for this uh, conceptual phase and uh, implementation maximum. For example, in this question, if I replace this lowest with highest, then what your option is going to be there? Then your option should be, sir, C option is there. Guys, question can be anything. I am just creating your concepts only. For example, from this graph, you can just tell anything. This is the graph project life cycle. This is the cost for your feasibility. Designing or feasibility is also known as conceptual. Okay, concepts of feasibility or like any analysis in next phase, you will get everything idea about feasibility analysis because of total feasibility analysis. What we will do from project uh, charter to project uh, uh, closure report, report from closing, everything we will discuss in our next uh, four or five modules. So, this is going to be this now. Just see, so this is the answer for this question. Conceptual will take minimum cost, so lowest cost are, it is asking for lowest. So concepts will take lowest. If we, it asks for IS, then implementation is going to be right answer. Now just uh, see in question five. In matrix organization, who is uh, responsible for some additionally workforce required? Just project manager, functional manager, team, board. Who is just responsible just to provide in matrix organization? Just listen properly. Last, uh, yesterday, I given second module and I given very important concepts of like organization, what project manager, what is the working, what different kinds of organizations. Everything is just we discussed there. Now, and one topic is just known as matrix organization. Matrix organization means, sir, it is the combination of some our functional manager, functional manager plus our project manager. Okay, functional and uh, it's the FM plus PM combination. Okay, functional manager and project manager. Just see. In matrix organization, who is responsible for some additionally workforce required? I just given 
project manager work is only to just complete some systematic work means some work some technical work or something is there okay what we need to just create for example we are creating phone only project manager will create this phone but who just work here how many persons working here what technical knowledge we are just putting here for everything especially organization just uh, recruit this functional manager functional manager work only for like uh, to manage proper work to provide proper uh, good uh, workforce to provide to require or to given proper technicians knowledgeful technician to this project manager and this project manager will give product okay so functional manager work only to provide some like uh, hr qualities work okay so in matrix only two thing is there last in last module we did just discuss everything so in matrix organization who is responsible for some additional workforce uh, required just only this uh, functional manager and important quality for this functional manager in weak matrix pm have limited power while in strong matrix functional manager have limited power just to see and uh, you will get a proper idea again i will teach something very important concept here just see we have matrix organization okay we have very important concept like uh, two persons are there so here two types of uh, matrix organization one is weak matrix one is strong matrix so in weak matrix what happen in weak matrix fm and pm again is here means functional manager is also there project manager is also there here again fm and pm both are available okay matrix organization is same okay there are two types of matrix organization first is just weak and second is just strong okay moderate between something is there but we will discuss weak and strong in moderate both powers are same in weak matrix organization in weak matrix organization p have limited power in weak matrix organization pm means for example this is the weak matrix okay our matrix is not strong functional manager very powerful very powerful means total charge of like everything functional manager is going to be head for this organization okay for weak matrix for example strong matrix is there functional manager is lowest power project manager is highest power okay so this strong matrix where project manager is just leader or lead here in weak matrix is what happen functional manager only just leader here okay project manager only just working for product okay so this is okay now two important concepts guys my every word just giving a concept and concept after my concept reading my concept go to any book any questions you will get every idea every word definitely okay but listen properly just uh, watch this video two times if you are not able to understand in one time because of these words are new day by day day by day you will get proper idea after ending of my project management you will get your standards and quality in uh, uh, two hour three hour only because of everything is new here i am giving i am developing your mind to just listen these words okay all words are new so just listen important project manager follow systematic approach while any problem okay while functional manager by analytical approach okay so sir we discussed matrix organization one is very important just known as matrix organization weak matrix strong matrix two persons are there one is a project manager one is just functional manager just one note is there just to see one note is there sorry i wrote here okay just see project manager project manager work on the systematic approach functional manager by analytic approach so we have sir matrix is there okay is strong and uh, matrix organization is strong and weak two persons are there functional manager and project manager so this fm will work this manager functional manager analytic approach analytic approach okay and this project manager systematic so just listen systematic means project manager all time work on the system okay some paper work is there how to create this phone how to just uh, make uh, some rules are there so everything just follow by this project manager so systematic approach just approach it or like uh, 
हु विल जस्ट अप्रोच सिस्टमेटिक अप्रोच दिस टाइप्स ऑफ क्वेश्चंस में आप ओनली और प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फंक्शनल मैनेजर इंप्लीमेंट विच अप्रोच विच अप्रोच इज दिस गाइस दिस इज एनालिटिकल अप्रोच एंड दिस इज अगेन वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एनालिटिक अप्रोच वी विल डिस्कस इन आवर स्टैंडर्ड्स एंड क्वालिटी हाउ व्हेनेवर हाउ टू मेंटेन क्वालिटी हाउ टू जस्ट गेट सॉल्यूशन सो फॉर स्मॉल योर आईडिया आई नीड टू जस्ट से एनालिटिक अप्रोच मींस फॉर एग्जांपल वन प्रॉब्लम इज देयर to resolve this problem don't see this 100% of this problem just break this problem into parts for example this 100% problem i am just dividing into four parts 25% 25% 25% 25% where i am getting problem in this part in this part in this part or in this part for example i am getting in this part only apply your 100% principles here and you will get 100% solution of this your problem same thing with your career also guys just listen properly i am taking your five minute time here to teach something very important to my all students same thing with your life for example your dream to become ias officer your problems are there okay many problems some financial problems your study problems something is there but everything is not problem for you guys just go to in your idea that's why i i functional manager is important or not but what approach they follow analytic approach are very very important just follow analytic approach in your life just break your all problems into parts for example my financial problems second my study third is just my resources so some financial problem is there some persons have study problem some persons are have problems of like resources only financial problems cannot stop you to become ias officer if you see this all problem as a one problem you will just have thinking that i cannot become ias officer but just break all your problems of your life into parts and where you are getting problem for example sir persons only having problem here you can take your idea you just listen your voice do something here but for example maximum students can manage here can manage here sir how to study your everything just useless how to study again study is again something like how to get some resources is there again take this problem and break into part so what happen if some problem is there if you are breaking into small parts you will get more ideas about something okay uh, i am not taking big example big example just to see for example your is 12 papers are there okay for your technical part so what you will do you will break into 12 parts 12 parts you need to just consider sir 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay 7 8 9 10 11 12 12 okay sir my strong parts are the six subjects are strong six are weak so where i need to work more this week subject in this subjects also you can just resolve sir 12 subjects out of three subjects are not important for is exam these three are important so i will prepare for these also so you can just break your problem into parts definitely you will get more idea just listen this 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 is not only word this is a statement i need to just say like analytic analytic is not only a small word it's a very very important word for your life just implement what i am just giving in standards and quality i will give more idea about like analytic approaches and everything so this is the matrix organization and the question for this answer for this question just uh, be a functional manager so in the matrix organization who is the responsible for some additional workforce requirement okay out of like um, any problem functional or like technical quality some manage managements are there some important works of uh, like uh, any anything uh, related to functional manager only responsible for in matrix organization then we seen just ma- strong matrix weak matrix and uh, analytic approach just uh, by our functional manager next just last question two questions are very important just listen here okay in last i will provide some seats for this uh, practice questions but now only these questions are sufficient this question i am giving only because of you will get more concepts every question you will get more concepts in question 6 in which document the stakeholders may have a record about issue and what done about them okay stakeholders yesterday we discussed what uh, affect your projects okay someone just affected by your project that is just known as stakeholder means who will just spend some money for example one 100 crore is project is there i need to spend 1 crore in this project so i am also a stakeholder this for project means and some partners for project for example uh, some psus are there psus are there so p in psu our government is also a stakeholder 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल फिफ्टी वन परसेंट गवर्नमेंट प्लस पब्लिक पब्लिक मीन सम शेयर आर देयर यू नो गाइज ओन जी सी शेयर शेयर मार्केट इज देयर और पब्लिक ऑल्सो स्टेक होल्डर फॉर लाइक कंपनी तो स्टेक होल्डर इज नथिंग जस्ट अ पार्टनरशिप इन आवर प्रोजेक्ट तो वोट डॉक्यूमेंट इज जस्ट रिकॉर्ड फॉर स्टेक होल्डर्स रिकॉर्ड अबाउट इशू एंड वोट डन अबाउट दैम एनी इशू इन प्रोजेक्ट For example, some person will come and they are uh, talking to project manager. Sir, I, my work is not completed. I need I in starting just you told I will give this product, but you are creating you are deviating from your target. So my money is going to be problem. So your project management manager will talk to you. Especially they will register a log, a problem, a complaint. That is just uh, known as issue log. Direct execution sometimes issue logs means some problems in project. so stakeholders our clients or anyone just getting some problem we will register a issue log for that and uh, try to this project manager try to resolve as soon as possible this issue logs okay so in the project manager management term we just known as issue log question 7 just see the first step of a successful project start up with your team is again guys start up with your team is again very very important team management work is there all project management means team management work so before start of any project before start of any project what you need to do meet with the team individually no hold a meeting before project start right provide the team with success criteria project no it is cannot like success you cannot say but uh, yeah in later part you can just um, say talk about how to success meetings or something but your first meeting is very important with uh, like uh, your team to know project manager will call everyone before starting our project they will talk to everyone okay everyone again because of project manager or our team if they interacted each other then they will know properly who is the responsible for this work who is the responsible for technical work from where we are getting resources who is the suppliers who is our owner how much is money is we are spending this project so everything before any starting of project meetings are important communication is important like uh, one statement is there nearly 58% projects just uh, fail because of lack of communication because of communication proper hoi nahi pata wahan pe there is no communication proper between managers between uh, like uh, seniors between juniors so that's why projects fail so nearly 60 70% projects are fail because of communication problem so communication is important meetings are very very important so often right b answer is right for any startup project in project management word this meetings is very very important this word a kick off meeting kick off meetings are very very important everyone who like uh, project manager just related to the any projects who just going for this kick off meetings so in the word of uh, meeting just only known as kick off okay a kick off kick off is nothing a meeting is the first meeting with the project team and clients of project clients means your customers may be there your sponsors may be there everyone just who related to your projects uh, just known as your clients okay so this word is kick off is important so kick off word just related to meetings first meetings with your project team okay so directly may they may ask a question kick off so in this product in this uh, like module we discuss many things okay if i want to add questions like what is the project what is the management hundred of question i can put here but i taken only very very this uh, seven questions every questions will give some concept and this concepts will build up your module one module second and extra parts of this module one and module second so this is my approach up to last and some extra questions you will get on the website also in test series if you want to join in test series you will get also in the reference books you will get lots of questions but your idea your concept is fixed definitely nothing is going to be changed so this is a module from our uh, first and second module questions here so thank you guys for watching this video thank you